So this is embarrassing. Last week, I recorded a trip to the Sword and Laser Mailbox that had three books, except I shouldn't use the word recorded because I didn't record it. I did one of those stupid things where I pressed the button twice. So you didn't get that video. Uh, I have the books here, and I have a brand new package from the Sword and Laser Mailbox. So I'm going to do this. You tell me, maybe you like this better than the actual packaging opening. I don't know. These are the books from last week. 100,000 Worlds, novel by Bob Prohl. This is the hardback version. Uh, jacket designed by Will Stale and jacket image by Ryan Deberardness, Deberardness and some Shutterstock uh, stuff. Uh, this is the one about Tori and her son Alex. Uh, she had a role on a cult sci-fi TV show, and uh, they have to run around, and there's a mystery. Uh, also, The Weaver's Lament by Elizabeth Hayden. Uh, this is jacket art by Stephen Yule. Uh, for a thousand years, the lands ruled by the Kimrian Alliance have been at peace. When the brutal death of a dear friend catapults the kingdom to the brink of civil war, Rhapsody finds herself in an impossible situation. And the one I was most excited about and the one I was so upset that I didn't record was Last Call at the Nightshade Lounge by Paul Kruger. Now, this is a cool book. Demons are real, booze is magic, and a well-mixed cocktail is Chicago's only hope. But excellent uh, beyond that is that Paul Kruger appeared in our Sword and Laser anthology. And this is his officially published book that he sent us. He sent a nice little note with it, too. Even uh, signed it for us, saying, tip your bartender because there might be demons involved. So there you go. Hope you enjoy those. Here is this week's from the Sword and Laser Mailbox. Yes, definitely recording. Here it is. Uh, Shadows of the Dark Crystal by J.M. Lee, a Grosset and Dunlap. Uh, Okay, doesn't give me the jacket design for some reason. Deep within the remote swamplands of Sog, a young Gelfling woman called Naya encounters a mysterious silver-haired traveler who brings life-altering news from the Almadra. Shadow of the Dark Crystal. And I uh, also don't have the release dates on those, but I have the release dates on this. On sale, June 28th. It's a nice-looking cover, actually. I like that. Uh, so anyway... Hope you're enjoying those. We have more great suggestions in our podcast at swordandlaser.com. Go check it out. See you there.